Now we're filming. Oh. Maybe we weren't filming before. <laughs> Who knows? Whatever. But this is. But you got you got like the meal. The meal. But not the. Which might be the sa- around the same price. I'm not sure because this is probably like sixteen ply. Right. Yep. So this was a little more expensive. Yeah. I I I'm 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 quite partial to getting like a burger, like a the double cheeseburger and a tea. Yep. Then I'll get a chicken sandwich and a tea. And then I'll get a French fries and a tea. So altogether, I'm spending about thirty-eight point seven yuan, something like that. And uh, yeah, and getting three drinks and just a regular meal. But I I, I like to have two of these little type of burgers. Mm. But if you just want one, you know, who's going to stop you, right? I just did the instinctive click the combo meal deal thing, which is the standard at fast food, which Absolutely. is never the best deal, but oh, it's it, not a bad deal. I mean, you know, it's what? What are you going to do with the with the two or three quai that you would have saved? Well, I could have just had two hamburgers instead. Or ridden the bus. Yeah. We're uh, getting ready. We're getting ready to go to I Cool Street. This is a Sean and Looks like Sean is coming into the McDonald's. Whoa, digital camera? Where the hell did you get that? I got digital. this. I know it's so digital. I got this from. Mm. I got this from Buy Now Hui back when it was open. Oh, nice. Oh, many, many years ago. Allow me to give up my seat so that you can sit yeah, tea, huh? he got a tea i got i got I, I, this is this is Ooh. some piping hot coffee that Ooh. i brought from home nice. <coughs> it smells really coffee right here that's cool i'm cold it's not it's not warm outside is it no it's about how many degrees would you say it is right Minus now 45 uh, was where we were about two hours ago, I think we're right We're now, probably hitting minus 27 now. I'm gonna... Can I... Well, I don't want to wager or anything. Oh, it says minus 23. I would have said worse. But that's straight temperature, not including wind chill. Yeah. Oh yeah, with wind chill, we're talking probably minus 30. That's cold. Yeah. Well, what's, what's even more cool, not cold, but what's cool is that we're very close to Cool Street. Now, I was walking down Cool Street and I didn't see anything open. Oh, no no joke. No, yeah, I, I walked the entire uh, street. Okay. There were a couple convenience stores open, but all the restaurants were You were doing a little bit of street walking? Yeah. 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 I got out by the, maybe by the music park, kind of. Okay. Well, well, we'll take a look and see what's going on there. Yeah, if there's okay. nothing going on there, then we'll just we're, go we're to the, the next line, place. Tom. Yeah. All right. <laughs> well, see, he seems like he's a little chilled. Well, welcome several blocks down Cool Street and this temperature could chill you out. Yeah, definitely. Maybe make you a little bit, uh, a little bit kind of uh, bristly, we'll say. But I'm nice and warm. I just, he's doing a good job of warming me up. It's good to have a hot drink on a cold day. Ceylon tea. Yeah, this is, this is from, from where? Sri Lanka. <laughs> one, would, one, would, one would hope. <laughs> That's what the claim That's is. That's what the claim is, <laughs> yeah. I, in, in my uh, little thermos, I prepared some uh, Vietnamese instant coffee, which I find it's much better than Nescafe. I've heard good things about that as well. Yeah, it's, it's just it regular black there. coffee. Regular, and it's cheaper than Nescafe as well. Uh, a pack of 30 packets costs 28 yuan. And right now I have two packets in here. But drinking just one packet in a mug is fine. So I've kept my tea a little on the redder side. Some people like to leave their bag in for a long time, but I'm one of those I'm people. Used, used to keep it really strong. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, if, if I get like the, three of them sort of too, British way of doing it. if I get three of them, I will. Maybe, yeah, I'll drink one and then take the bag and put it into the next one. Yeah. 
Yeah, but that's that, I know it's that, that's a little crazy. I feel wasteful with, with this size of a tea bag. I could drink probably three cups of this coffee, of this. Tea. Oh, okay. So you're one of those kinds of. I I I, I know I know people like that. Yeah. Because yeah. I like it very mild. I like it to be <sighs> just still kind of red color. Yeah. Well, we're not really going for flavor so so much as just warmth. Yeah. It's yeah. Warm. Yeah. 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 And has a nice mild tea flavor. Yeah. I don't like the bitter. Once it gets starts getting bitter, I'm not. Okay. Yeah. Uh, for me, I I like the bitterness, but you know, it's just uh, different people have different ways of going about their business, don't they? Different tea preferences. That's right. That's right. Are you a standard McDonald's French fry guy? Yeah. Because I don't particularly like their French. Oh. <laughs> Why is that? Take. I don't know, like. I like bigger crunch. I like. I like this kind of a fry. Right. I like it to have like some crunch on the outside. Oh, and some fluff in the middle. And some fluff in the middle. Yeah. I hear you. I hear you. Yeah. No, I like I like regular oh. fries, but I don't really eat them very often. I mean, I enjoy McDonald's fries, but I, in my opinion, they're not. They're not all they're hyped up to be. Yeah. I hear that. I, I quite like them, but I wouldn't say that, yeah, I'm not, I don't go out of my way to eat them. When they are cooked correctly, I prefer the Burger King fries. Oh, that is huge. But typically, the people working in China don't put the seasoning on. They just cook the fries. Ah. Uh, put the, because it's like a seasoning. There. Right, yeah, they, it's kind of like this stuff that they, they have. They very rarely remember to put that on. Yeah. So, when they, when it has the seasoning on it, well, it's cooked. Yeah, Crazy. McDonald's generally has bathrooms. No, something. in a mall, that's weird. Yeah, the mall is a community mall. Yeah, usually you gotta walk like 20 minutes in a place like. Is this the Wong Fu Jing Mall? No. Oh, okay. This is just. I hate that place. This is just a mall. Uh, yeah, I've, I've never been in a place well, so. that's harder to get out of. Like, I went down to the supermarket once, and I didn't retra retrace my steps. Uh, it might have been the day that we were at. Um, we were at some going away party uh, down the street from here, maybe. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I remember. Yeah, you went to go get beers or something. I went to get beers, and it took me about 30 minutes not to come back, but just to get out of the mall. I remember that. Yeah, you were gone for a while. <laughs> One thing about that gone mall... For a long time. Oh, oh, shoot, I forgot what I was going to say. But, yeah, no, that mall is uh, its a pain in the tail. Yeah. I've only been in there a couple of times. I don't like. I don't. I generally don't like malls, to tell you the truth. No, I, I went in there to get cold beer because no shops around us had cold beer. Yeah, this area doesn't really do shops very well. Yeah. There was one shop and it had... The warm very, beer. It had hot beer. Yeah, it, yeah, yeah, it was, it was in the summertime yeah, the summer and it had hot beer. beer. Hot <laughs> beer. And some, some beer is okay to enjoy hot, but uh, not this. No. That would have been like uh, snow in bottles or something like that. This mall is kind of weird because it's identical to the other mall that's two blocks down the street. Yeah. So that's that's kind of weird. Well, I'm going to use the restroom. Okay. i take advantage of the facilities. That's right. If you have the opportunity, you should. I don't think I've ever been in this mall. I've only ever been to this part of town, like, two or three times. Right, when we went to Cool Street. Yeah. Uh, the one time I came down here in the summer with the electric um, share bikes. Ah, uh -huh, yes, yeah. You, you were big on those. You were big on yeah. those. Because the range here comes all the way down here and then out. It goes to the like the full to extent. To the green to, bridge. Yeah. Yeah. And I just one night after I was at the bar or whatever, I got one of his bikes and rode it. So I hit the edge of the, the zone, and then like I did a full circuit. And then you're like, the okay, area. time to turn it around. It was like a two-hour ride. Was it giving you the uh, the emergency light and the... Oh, the, the, you're out of zone? <laughs> no, no, I, I Get back in the, the zone. This bike will self-destruct. <laughs> <laughs> I, was, I was checking the map to make sure yeah, I stayed like today, zone. Just riding the bus is pretty sick. I enjoy it. Yeah, we had fun this on the nice bus. Cool. We took a we had a great bus. It's yeah, great I had a more. good bus, but not a good uh, time waiting. It was 25 minutes, I think. Yeah, we waited for quite a while as well, and my feet began to get yeah, a little yeah, bit frozen. Yeah, my a little feet, frozen. My feet too. Then when we got we were on the bus, my feet were still cold. Yeah. But then when we got off, we went for a little walk, and like now I'm in uh, I'm in business. Yeah, once I start moving, then I'm 
okay usually. So what'd you yeah, order there, Sean? What'd you order? Oh, small coffee. It's uh, it's my second one today. Hey, that's cool. I. Uh, How was your first coffee today? Real good. Yeah, I went and went to the supermarket to grab some groceries for today, and then was uh. He, yeah, I've, I've been buying most of my groceries fresh every morning uh, or every afternoon when I'm. Oh, that's that's like that's classic. Uh, yeah, I'm practicing mindful eating. It's where you uh, you, sec you secure all the ingredients uh, on on their own individually. Oh, is that what they call it? Yeah. Instead of getting a whole bunch of stuff and then figuring out what to do with it. It's uh, a nice fancy word, and I like them. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Mindful eating. Uh, I remember you said something about your experience this morning at that you, you kind of had a win this morning or this afternoon at your, your local yeah, McDonald's. Yeah, uh, I've been recognized as a regular at my uh, neighborhood McDonald's and I'm really happy that I have a neighborhood McDonald's because... When you say neighborhood, how far is it to walk to that um, McDonald's? You know, like, in, in neighborhood time. meaning within a 10 minute walk. That's great. Yeah, my lo my lo my closest one would probably be about 15 to 20 minute walk, but it's not really that nice. Like, it's the one in... Uh, Fujuan Chung. Well, we went there. Yeah, yeah you went. remember when? I mean, it's like, eh. They have the food. It's just I, I like the atmosphere. Now this one is real nice. This is a nice but McDonald's. It's the kind of place that would fill up super, super fast where I'm at. Well, yeah. Also, I mean, just, they don't have a lot of tables. This mall's dead right now, so like it's like the amount yeah. of unused space is really amazing here. We could do some dead mall walking. How many tables could be here? A lot. No. Yeah. But there's there are no tables here. I guess maybe they thought there'd be a huge rush of people and then they'd just have them all standing around doing nothing. Mm. Like, have them all standing like, Is my order ready? Is they do more sort of McCafe crap stuff here and people just eat it in the mall. Yeah, okay. As opposed to... Yeah, this is more of an ice cream. Yeah. You grab your, hot eats, cool like, treats. They need a big area for people to stand waiting for their ice cream to get poured when they're going to carry that, like, eat the ice cream while walking around the mall. Oh, yeah. Okay. Well, this is really fun and extremely exciting. And I don't know about you, Robin, but I'm pretty I'm pretty stoked to go check out Cool Street, even though it might be dead. I'm still willing to check it out. Yeah. Um, I wasn't a hundred percent saying that they're all closed. One or two was open for sure that I know. But okay. I'm not sure if there are kind of place. Or well, we're not saying like the thing is was that we're not. We're not even saying that we're going to go to the same place that we went to before. Yeah. We're just going to go there and see what's open, if there's anything open. Like, like I was I was kind of thinking it'd be cool to check out one of those Japanese snacky places that they have there. I could swear I saw that place open. Yeah, see? Maybe that was the one place yeah. that I saw Yeah, open. maybe get some goyoza. The, pizza, the pizzeria is closed, and what no seemed big like a loss. few Calro restaurants were closed. No too. big loss with that pizzeria yeah. being closed, yeah. tell you that much. Called Chow. In Chinese, they're called Wotia. Right. That's the same word. Well, there you have the writing it. Writing is the same. Oh, the yeah, okay. Japanese. Makes sense. Makes sense. Yeah, Makes the. Sense. Well, Chow means both hello and goodbye. It's like aloha. Right. Yeah. So it could mean goodbye. Yeah, I'd, I'd like to say goodbye to that pizzeria. That's, I know it as goodbye, but I remember. Oh, yeah, it's like aloha. They always say, yeah, they say Chow is hello too. Yeah, it's like salutations. Yeah, have you tried their pizza at that place? No. Yeah. I heard it's okay, but like not. Uh, they need, like I said, I've said this before. I'll say it again. They need to uh, heat up. They need to let it stay in the oven a little longer, so that the crust oh, can yeah. get a little bit more crispy. Because I hear what they're trying to do is like this traditional style Italian, like stone, you know, whatever. Yeah. Not stone. The oven, whole point whatever. is you. Brick it's got to be like. It's got to have those little burn marks all over it. It's yeah, and it doesn't have them. It doesn't have yeah, them. Yeah, if I don't have the, the marks. That's a common problem with pizza places in China. Yeah. China. The, 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 it, it's doughy. The, pizza, yeah. the thing is, is that the sauce because that they use is really good. Yeah. Often they the make sauce that's really good. good. You know, there's another place in Harbin that could do with cooking their pizza a little longer. Oh, yeah? What's that? Uh, something like <laughs> atmosphere. <laughs> oh. Uh huh. Earth, at least Earth Bar. Yeah, that, yeah, yeah. No, I hear you. I hear you. I hear you. Sometimes it's like that there. Sometimes it's not. It's yeah, kind of no, a hit it, or miss it, situation. It can be very good. Yeah. It probably depends on how busy they are. Yeah. Yeah. How many pizzas are in the, the oven? Yeah. Yeah. I had bad luck my last couple <coughs> times, but 
Yeah, it's pretty good. I'm just, just saying. Whatever, you know. Look, we're making conversation here. We're, yeah, we're not, and we're not, we're not out to get anybody today. All right, but this if you ever are, you let me know. Yeah. <laughs> I'll get my consumer advocacy people after them. That's a good idea. That's a good idea. Contact the Better Business Bureau. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Nice fat Albert laugh. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think uh, for now. Is that a Warner Brothers uh, uh, jacket? No, that's just like a little angry devil. On oh, the back okay. Of it looked like a 1930s. <laughs> maybe it was like a, maybe the Catholic Church had their own uh, cartoons back then. That'd be cool. Like, uh, what was it, Davy and Goliath in the 50s? They had uh, the Davy and Goliath show. <laughs> <laughs> I think that was the Church of Latter-day Saints. But wow. If the Catholic Church had an EWTN original cartoons. You know, that'd, like be, I would, that'd be okay with me. That would yeah. be okay with me. Yeah. But they would have to do, like, I'd like to see, like, the adventures of Paul the Apostle. Okay. You know, something like that. Or also, yeah, the further adventures of of the see. disciples. Well, I like oh, devils I because... Old, Old Testament stuff. Old Testament is much more exciting than New Testament. I know, but if the Catholic Church would do it, it would probably be mostly probably New Testament New stuff. stuff. Yeah. But I'd like I to see... Like, no, you know. They did They did Old Testament... There are Old Testament oh, cartoons. Uh, I've, I've seen, like, uh, there were, like, some Old Testament animes or something. They're like, in, uh, like, Shuki Levy... Hames the Don and Shuki Levy. Remember them? They used to make cartoons, like... Inspector Gadget. Shugi Levy made um, Power Rangers as well. Yeah. Yes. 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 Uh, Israeli, right? Yes. Yes. Because yeah. yes. uh, their production company uh, made Power Rangers. And, right. Yeah, it was all a certain type of name. Yeah. That I, I would be like, that's not Japanese. Yeah, I remember that name, Haim Haim. But Shuki Levy kind of got me as like a ten-year-old. I was, you know, kind of ignorant. Yeah, you're like Shuki Levy. Shuki, Shuki, mm, that, 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 that right. could be worth. That could work. And then my mom's like, no, 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 no. Jews. <laughs> and I'm like, okay. Oh well, there you have it. Well, Robin, my mom can spot a Jew a mile away. You have completed your meal. I've completed my meal. I'm very satisfied now. Would you or order those French fries again if given the chance? Yes. That's great. I found them to be superior to the standard fries. Uh, if you could give it a one out of five for this meal that you just consumed. Um, I would say it's, for the time and situation, that I give that a four. Okay. Five. Now, if you had regular fries, would it be a three? Probably. Okay. It depends. What kind of tiao if did you get? He got those. Those are the, the shoe yeah, that he, yeah, got, he got. They were fancy. They were uh, ridged. Was like Ruffles has ridges. They had ridges. Oh, like crinkle cut. They're crinkle cut. That's right, sweet, Mr. Crinkle. Mr. Crinkle. Mr. Now, crinkle. Now I actually Mr. just Christy. ate Ruffles uh, the other day. I bought Ruffles from Metro. Ruffles have ridges. ridges. Yes. <laughs> and I, I, I didn't have any dip, so I used mayonnaise. Oh, that's mayonnaise okay. and mustard together. Ooh, that's a, a classic. Stick. That's a, a classic. Little squirt of mu uh, mustard. Actually, you know what goes Sometimes great go with a hot dog? Hard. With a hot dog, like an outdoor grilled hot dog yeah. in the summer. You got your chips, and then you just dip the chips in mustard. I, I, with your I, hot dog. Ori Laser Originals and mustard and a little Tabasco sauce. Oh, a little is often Tabasco. often my summertime thing. That's pretty cool. A little too thick for um, uh, if you put mayonnaise in it. Yeah. I, I'm not a big fan of that in summer, but uh, with a nice Ruffles chip, you got you, it's the whole point of the, the ridges is to you know, hold the dip. That's right. You got the dip. Yeah. It holds uh, you know, a runny dip or a thick dip, whatever. You know? Also, that's, Chunky. back in the day, they used to say that... Uh, because it had ridges, you get more chip. Because it's like an accordion, you know, uh, like like yeah, 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 yeah. It's, I, I didn't understand it for if you pull it apart, chip, it's like yeah. six. Yeah, feet yeah, it's long. like six feet long. Yeah, 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 each one. Yeah. Well, these are ridges too. <laughs> yeah. Although I think you're actually. Getting by the way, that would show up in the weight. Chips are measured by weight, you know. Like, nah, whatever, so whatever. I think I, that's. Yeah, you're not getting more chips. As a consumer advocate, I don't know about that's, that. That type of stuff. It works for. It works it's on marketing. Kids. It's yeah, marketing. It works on kids yeah. and stupid people. But yeah. I mean, well, it, yeah, it, it is accurate. Chips are for that dumb if you people. have each have yeah. one chip of the same area, it will be more chip. It'll be. Like, is you're it buying like a, a bag that's based on weight? As John said. So. Yeah. It's like that. It's like the uh, like we, you know when they try to measure the circumference of a sea line or a, a coastline yeah. on a country. The more accurate you get, the longer it gets. Yeah, yeah. Maybe that's the same thing with the chips. Could be. 
These are the, the, I looked at the thing. Sean asked, what kind of fries are they? They are the golden, crispy, crispy fries. Oh, nice. Double crisp. Yeah. Well, I can't read the first three characters. That's okay. Something maybe... Yeah, I saw the golden. Seasoning, go yeah, golden seasoned, yeah. crispy, crispy fries. I don't know. I can read the character. It says, Rijin Liao Jin. But I don't know what that means. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I know the gin at the end means gold. So it's something golden. Maybe perhaps seasoning. Golden seasoning. Any of you cytophiles that want to check this out. <laughs> yeah. and, uh... If it'll focus on it. So a cytophile. <laughs> That's someone who really likes Chinese things. Yeah, like McDonald's. Yeah. yeah. Hey, the menu, yeah, the menus was in like, Chinese. Yeah, exactly. Coffee. Yeah. Ruffles. I, I think I could have ordered in English. I don't know if it prints an English receipt if you order in English. I don't think it. Oh no 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 no! no. I think it. that's for their purposes. Okay. So I don't know. It. That's a good. Could question. you imagine the bookkeeping they'd have to do if, like, on their records, it all showed up in well, English? I on their side. I know it'd be funny Chinese, if it did. Though. But on my ticket, it potentially could print in English. My wife worked at McDonald's, and I think one of her special skills was that she was uh, an English speaker. I don't know if she was good Bottoms at any up. other part of her job, but uh, Starbucks we as well. Bottoms up. I went, to a, the, I went to a McDonald's in Shanghai back in 2006. There you go, 2006, yeah. It's December of 2006. Mm, and, I remember, and I remember when I went to the McDonald's there, I went to order and they were like, hello, sir, may I take your order in English? Yeah. And I was like, I was like, Whoa. Are you here for business or travel? That's yeah, 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 yeah. I got yeah. for pleasure. I got at a KFC once in the yeah, for. I was like, what the hell? Okay. And then I, I mean, I, I, and then I ordered it, whatever. But it's funny because at the time I was teaching students who, like, their dream was to come and work in Shanghai. They were learning English so that they could, like, really? get out of the village yeah, and work. And, no, yeah, when I came not, back, I told them, I was dream. like, I was like, yeah, you know where English can get you in Shanghai? Can get you a job at McDonald's. It's Apparently not. It's good work. Yeah. yeah. No, I mean, it's better than, honestly, working at McDonald's is better than working a lot of other places. And because they follow it, it, rules. Yeah. The, they pay better, they also. Have better pay than a comparable restaurant jobs. Yeah. And better than Decos. Yeah. And they have company policies that they actually follow. Yes. The fun thing about Decos to mention is uh, uh, someone recently said that their favorite chicken burger. <laughs> was and I was. Appalled by that. Well, did you see what the comments said about that? Oh, no, did everyone one was of, in support of uh, just shutting down that idea. Did you see what one, one person commented? You know what they said? No. They said, that's laughable. <laughs> Not laughable. Yeah. <laughs> yeah I, 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 I do like their french fries. It's just silly. What a silly yeah. thing to say. That person fries. was me. Yeah. Are, are you, so, what, what is your opinion? Are you Wallace people? Or as far as chain chicken burgers? Because, like, I assume the comment meant about as far as chain chicken burgers. I'm, well, I know I'm definitely not a Deco's person, but I mean, honestly... For overall for, value, I'd say Wallace. Wallace for value, yeah. yeah. I mean, honestly, I, I I would just go to whatever your local, yes. you know, grandma, two My chicken sandwiches chicken for ten No wide. two people in two different, like, districts go to the same place yes. or order from the same place. Yeah, <coughs> but I mean, I, can, I guess, like, nervous. if I'm going to have to eat, like budget chicken sandwiches yeah i'll go wallace, I would, as, I would say, wallace. as you were saying i would also recommend there are lots of little fast food independent mom and pop yeah. fast food chicken burgers. i would do that and i mean i would do that we have a mexican burger at the one next to my house it's like yeah what's it good stuff that kfc tried or you know mcdonald's tried and yeah. it's a seasonal thing but I, they do it year round yeah all they had to do is put jalapenos love on the little, little shops will pick up something that was a one-off yeah. item and then they'll, they'll roll McDonald's with it and they'll just be like oh well, this is what we're we have do the now. stuff to make it there's no oh, actually dude you know oh, i just remembered one of my favorite brand one of my favorite um chains is blue shine do you know blue shine they used to have a, an outlet next to my house, but then uh, went under. But like the dude, okay, it was like it's it was like a it probably has pretty cheap franchise fees, and like the guy who ran the one by my house, like I would come in and order fries, and he would make the fries right there and then, and he'd always give me like a bunch of he like hooked me up, he always gave me extra, and he'd be uh, like, hey, I hooked you up. Yeah, yeah, he'd yeah. be like, he'd be like, hey, this one, you know, it looks like you want, you look, you came to order three fries, yeah. I gave you four, you know, like that kind of thing. But his sandwiches were good too, and the chicken wraps were really good. I threw a little bit of sriracha. So honestly, Blue Shine is better than Wallace, but Wallace definitely has more coverage. 
Yeah. That's that, that's why people recommend Wallace. It's because it's everywhere and it's cheap and it's not bad. It's a nice chain, um, or it'd be Lawless. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> well, you can go to Law Sons yeah. too, but yeah, Lawless. That's no, that's funny. Thank you. Um, but I would say that actually, if 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 that person who reposted that thing said. All right, then. Why don't you tell me? Why don't you tell me which ones, which ones are best chicken burger in all of China? I would probably say um, I'm. I like the uh, the McDonald's. Uh, McDonald's chicken, chicken is better. McChicken. Than chicken. Just the the, the one that's just menu, just a, the giant uh, chicken nugget mm. on between two pieces of bread with a dollop, dollop of mayonnaise and a little uh, a, a dollop, little, yeah. little I, handful I would, of uh, a little handful uh, of we're going of less. Western fast food places. I would go. With the, Spicy chicken, KFC. But the value, there's no value there. It's like 19 quai. Yeah, dude, if I'm just getting like free 12. food. No, dude, rather. they're hell of expensive. Oh. Yeah. Well, I think it's time for us to mosey. What do you guys yeah, think? Yeah, we gotta start walking. We gotta go take a look. At what's digital going on. cameras, batteries don't take the cold very well. They certainly don't. That's Especially why I'm gonna have to turn this off. Snow world. Yeah, I, I brought two actually. I have yeah. this one and another one. Well, anyway, uh, off we go, and I hope that all of our friends out there in YouTube land, I hope they enjoy the time that we've spent with them here at this McDonald's. Bye. See yeah. you later. <laughs>